well, here's my cowboy camping setup from last night. Tie back. My sweet pack, which acts as the other part of my sleeping system. Torso pad, quilt, pillow. Check out what I did with this genius thing. I'm on a bit of a slant. So I put a big old rock here at the bottom of my pack so that if I started to roll sideways or my pack started to slide, maybe it would stop it. And honestly, I woke up like right on the edge of that, but not in the dirt. So I think it did work. Yeah. Cowboy camping. I saw a shooting star. It was awesome. <laughs> I got to pack up. A bunch of people, no, two people have already walked by. This is a fun part of cowboy camping, kind of. Two people have already walked by. <laughs> you know, they're already off on their hike, and I'm just, like, sitting here in my bed, drinking my coffee, watching the sun light up the hills and stuff. It's nice. <laughs> I finished brushing my teeth and cleaned up so I could take a nice picture with the 100 mile sign I have no idea if it is though because it's so bright I can't see my screen but yeah 100 miles baby oh maybe that's 100 miles oh this one's even better what are you doing little beetle that's weird Water source. There he is. Is that a rat? Whoa, I didn't know that crows were like that. Somebody else said they saw a rat out here. Gross. Water. This section's gonna be pretty nice. There's more water in five and seven. So cool. Oh, mamma jamma. That was slippery. <laughs> you little fella. That's Eagle Rock up there. Look at what I'm walking out of. So rad. <laughs> Oh, you are a brave little cow. You want to come with me? You want to walk to Canada? Do you want to? Look at this glorious just pool of shade. Man, so nice. All the cows are about. I tried to get this little baby one to come with me. Clearly it didn't. Dude, that tree is massive. It reminds me of that whomping tree from Harry Potter. <laughs> oh, it's hot. More water. This is awesome. I need a break. It is hot. So, busted out my tie back. Propped up on my pack. I'm gonna eat my lunch and drink a bunch of water. And I think I'm gonna do the rest of my hike once it starts to get cooler out. I'm a night hike baby. Maybe like 15 more miles. Going into Idlewild in like two days. I'm climbing up into all that. Like right now. <laughs> Woo. Man. I was just coming around this corner in the trail and whoa, beautiful. It's gonna be a nice sunset. It's supposed to be good weather. Maybe I can cowboy camp again. We'll see. 
It's going to be awesome. <laughs> They're big. Wow. See all the rocks just like jutting up out of the ground? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Things are changing again. I love it. Amazing. Well, I made it to Mike's place. Makes it like a whew, all are welcome. I wonder if I can camp here. I'm at like twenty nine miles for the day. really into post-apocalyptic books and that is definitely what that made me think of <laughs> 